everybody, I'm Jedi Jack Penguin, and today I'm bringing you another miniature review. So today I have a The Lego Movie 2 polybag, that being set number 30527, Lucy vs. Alien Invader. This set contains 44 pieces, and I got this for $3.99 at my local Walmart store. Not really my real local Walmart store, but one of my local Walmart stores, which had it a little bit before the other one that I went to before that to actually try and find this when I didn't find it or the Metal Beard one so it's just a big loop of me searching for LEGO Movie 2 poly bags and either not finding them or actually finding them but I am actually going to look for more poly bags today while this video is being released I don't know if I'll have a haul video out before or after this or whatever but let's just continue with the review so we have the main poly bag right here. This came out just earlier this month. We got the Lego and the Lego Movie 2 logos right there at the top, and then we have the main set picture right there inside a nice little Lego Movie background. You can also see that we have the direct-to-consumer set hiding inside this the picture, which is, I guess, a little bit of a teaser because it wasn't released or shown yet. And then we have the back of the poly bag, which has a Legoland stuff. We also have the Lego logo set number as well as the barcode. So if you're looking for this poly bag, this is the barcode for it. But I don't think you'll be able to find it through there since it's poly bags. So poly bags are very hard to find. So let's open this up and see what's inside. Okay, so here is the final overall model for the set. I decided I might as well have just built it up since it is one minifigure and one character. We do get one instruction page right here, which we have the main picture right there. We also have the wind guy on that side. We build our character and then we build the Duplo Invader. And then we do get some advertisements on the back right here. I do own Emmett's Thricycle. I will be reviewing that probably next month just for the Lego Movie 2. I do own 70827, which is the Ultra Caddy and Warrior Lucy set. You can see that review in the description below or card above. I do have eventual plans of getting 70826. And, and I don't think I'm probably going to get that set. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But... Otherwise, that's pretty much all for the instructions, bringing us to our overall model. We do get three extra pieces down here. You can see we have one light gray Technic pin. We also have a one by one orange plate piece, as well as a one by one circular blue tile right there, which are all used on the Duplo Invader character. And then we have our overall character. So let's take a quick look at Lucy. Okay, so here is our minifigure of Lucy. She is not exclusive to this set. She also comes inside the Ultra Caddy and Warrior Lucy set, which I reviewed, and also Sweet Mayhem's Sistar Starship. So if you want a cheap way at getting a Lucy minifigure, this is probably the cheapest way to get her character inside this new format with the new hairpiece and also the new sort of wrapped scarf piece as well, and also these very nice dual molded legs. She comes with one accessory being this crossbow. She also comes with some arrows on her back, which goes underneath her neck like her other scarf piece. You can remove that accessory quickly. She has some very nice dual molding on her legs right there with the dark brown and also the black right there. Very nice, really like that. And also some printing on her belt piece as well as on her torso and also, and also on this arm in black. We also get a black hand on that side. We have some printing minorly right here on this arm as well, and also a yellow hand. As for her hairpiece, I really love the dual molding on that for the goggles. Very nice, really like that. She does have two facial expressions, that one, and then we do get another one if we turn around her head, which she's not so happy in that one. A little bit more accurate compared to the trailers that we currently see, since... Everything is not awesome in Apocalypse Berg right now since the Duplo invaders are invading and that's why we get a Duplo invader character so let's take a quick look at them. So the other item that comes within this poly bag is the Duplo invader which compared to the other one that I got inside the Ultra Caddy and Warrior Lucy set this one is different colors it does have the same blue on the bottom but it has but it has orange on the top instead of the lime green color and also it doesn't have that feature where you can sort of like turn around its eyes since it's attached to these two studs right there on the front. Also very nice we get this exclusive 2x2 printed piece right there circular in black for the eye of the Duplo Invader which 
The only play feature that's featured on this character is that you can have them sort of, I guess, bite your characters, I guess. That's what they are here. I guess they're here to eat them, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't seen the movie yet. I do plan on eventually seeing this movie, and then I'll probably do some better accurate videos based on the sets and do some collection videos and stuff since I do plan on doing collection videos in the future. So yeah, that's pretty much all for this set. Very nice for $4 you get a minifigure which is, though it's not exclusive, it's very nice to actually get this character with the dual molded legs inside a nice $3 poly bag. And then also you get pieces to build the Duplo Invader which, you know, I don't know how many of these are going to be inside the movie so it's very nice to actually get one. So. You can build up an army with these sets that you buy, so yeah, that's pretty much all for this video. Remember to like and subscribe and hit that bell icon so every time I upload a new video. So yeah, that's it for now, and I will see you next time. Bye!